I have been very fortunate to, I guess, not surround myself with peers, but obviously it's cost me money. I've paid, I've paid for the services along the way, but absolutely, you know, non-executive directors, board advisors, uh, you know, business coaches. I've just reconnected with one of my very first business coaches, a guy called Casey Gollan. Um, absolute machine. Anyone who's looking for a business coach between you know that probably two to ten mil mark is um, is work wonders. He did a lot of work with the guys um, over at. Mm-hmm. That'll come to me, uh, but yeah, he, he's a great guy. I've done a lot of work with a guy called Mike Wormsley, non-executive director. Um, Sorry, Big Commerce was the company um, that Casey did a lot of work with, helped those guys launch that. Um, mm-hmm. Greg Savage, now basically I've done one-on-one with Greg Savage, again, arguably the, the godfather of recruitment, um, and then a number of other peers as well. So I think when the chips are down or when the confidence is down, it's always kind of going back to the drawing board and going back to basics. Um, I don't think you can you can go too wrong by doing that. You know, Again, recruitment is not difficult. A lot of people do make it a lot harder than what it needs to be and they overcomplicate things. But I think it's just going back to that, again, do the right thing. You know, um, your reputation is key. And it's such an inc- in such an incestuous industry that all it takes is, you know, that one remark, that one comment, that one placement, um, you know, and potentially your whole career is in, in, t- mm-hmm. in talent. Mm-hmm.